Hey everyone, it's Amy. Welcome back. This is a buy package. I'm so excited. Oh, it's going to be a great haul. I already feel it. <laughs> but thank you so much to Bayi for sponsoring today's video. I'm always so thankful when I get to collab with them. And I'm sorry if um, my camera is very shaky right now. <laughs> I got a new uh, camera stand. It's an arm that goes over, that puts the camera over my desk. And um, I feel like the point of view is a lot better, but sometimes there's going to be some shakiness. Okay, so here we go. Oh my gosh, I am so excited for this. <laughs> wow! <laughs> this is so full. Oh my goodness. Wow. This is wild. Look at all these envelopes. And there's quite a few heavy things in here as well. Okay, now that I'm all situated, we can start opening all these things. These are the two bigger items and they're a little bit heavier, so I thought maybe I'll just go ahead and start with those. But like I was saying in the beginning of the video that this is a sponsored video with Bayi. And if you're not familiar with Bayi or what type of services they provide, they are a Japanese proxy service. Basically, if you need anything from certain Japanese stores, you can use Bayi to be kind of like the middleman and they will buy the stuff for you. In my case and for the purpose of this channel, I limited everything to Mercari Japan because I wanted to get K-pop stuff. So, wow, I didn't realize how many of these sleeves that I got, but um, I got some clear sleeves to go into my A5 binders and this is just one of the many things that you can get off of Mercari Japan and have Bayi uh, purchase it for you. I have collabed with Bayi a few times in the past and I also have used them completely on my own and I will say that they are probably my favorite proxy service. They are just so so quick in getting your item from the time that it arrives at the warehouse to updating your account that it's arrived and they are so quick to purchase your item on Mercari Japan because they have a direct partnership with Mercari Japan and everything is just very smooth, very seamless, and overall I just have always had really great experiences with them. So yes, if you are interested in checking them out or trying them out for the first time, check out the link in the description below because I will have a link there that you can use and it'll get you a discount on your first order. I believe the discount is for 2,000 yen, which is uh, roughly 20-ish dollars. So yeah, that's a really good deal. And yeah, as you can see, I don't just always limit it to just photo cards. Like if I do need binder supplies like this, I got these Amifa pockets and these are all of the A5 size uh, four pockets and I love these a lot. I've been using them um, in my 17 binders recently. So now let's take a look at what this thing is. I kind of have a feeling, oh no. It, the blade just broke off of this. <laughs> Hold on. Oh no, where'd it go? Oh, that is scary. Alrighty, well, since that cutter broke, I'll just use my scissors. <laughs> but let's see, is this, is this it? Um, so yeah, I have a feeling these might be more pockets. Oh no, you know what? <laughs> Okay, so it is a 17 related thing. In fact, I think pretty much everything in this haul, it might be 17, I think. There might be some stuff for the boys as well, but I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's going to be 17 because, you know, that's the collection that I've mainly been focusing on right now. All right, <laughs> so I got a Going 17. Now I don't plan on trying to collect like all of their older albums, but this came with the photo cards that I was missing. And it ended up just being a better deal if I bought it with the album. But let's take a look here. Um, oh, here they all are. Oh wow, everything's in here, okay. <laughs> so I needed this unit card with Joshua, so we got that, and I was missing this DK card as well. 
so it worked out really well to get both of these and then it has this little ore for uh, Joshua as well and I'm not collecting these but you know it was just a nice little bonus all right so I believe everything else is going to be photo cards so let me cut all these out and then I'll come right back I am kind of in disbelief okay we're gonna probably be here for a while we need to get everything opened let's try to get more organized here all right so the other obvious items that i also got were some more amifa pockets these are the two pockets yes they go like this um, yeah, I was just running really low on these and I was kind of burning through them faster than I ever expected. So we got one, two, three, four, five more packs. So that's 50 more of these sheets. Let's just start opening all the other things. And this is, um, oh, we have a going 17. Well, that's appropriate since we just opened the album but it is another unit card that I needed. So it's interesting because I collect both DK and Joshua. Um, I'm gonna actually need two of these because they have their own separate binder and they happen to share one unit card. So I'm gonna have to put this like either in my DK binder or my Joshua binder. Um, and then I'll probably try to find this one more locally. Maybe if you're selling it on Instagram or something, let me know. I would prefer to buy from someone in the US though, just to save a little bit on international transaction fees. But yeah, I'll probably buy it if it's a good price. All right, moving on. This looks like a Joshua card because it has his name right here on the back. <laughs> okay, this is his fourth membership. Yeah, the fourth carat membership card. And I just love the pink and the blue and I just think it's super, super cute. So really happy to have that. Oh my goodness, I am going to have so many um, like packing materials and stuff that I can hold on to and reuse. Let's try to gently cut through this. Oh no. <laughs> what is this going to be? Ooh, oh my gosh, I actually forgot. It's really sad when you forget exactly what all is coming. So I finally decided to start working on some of the You Make My Day collection. So we got DK set. I've had some pretty good luck finding sets for DK. Not as much luck finding sets for Joshua yet. Um, although I do have one Joshua set in here, which we will see in a little bit. And then it also was included with this HMV card. So yeah, but I am so grateful to have these. And here are the backs. I've been using white sleeves in my binders, but there's some cards where I'm like, mm, the backs are really cute. I don't know. Maybe I should use clear. I don't know. We'll see. But for now, I'm happy with the white sleeves I've been using. I just wanted to take a second to acknowledge this really, really cute stationery. This is so adorable. I don't know if Melanie is watching this, but this was for her for sure. <laughs> Alrighty, let's keep going. I feel like we're going to be here forever. <laughs> This is definitely, yeah, just one Joshua card <laughs> from Going 17. He's so cute. This one is, surprise, surprise, another 17 card. Honestly, I think this is like 99.9% .9 17. <laughs> uh, this is from Teenage. Wow, I don't know how they got this top loader to fit in there. All right, oh, I love the back of that. Very, very pretty. And this is DK. So cute. We'll take him out. Yes, I am making such good progress with my DK collection. Okay, moving forward. Oh dear, well, <laughs> hello, surprise. This is a Joshua card. Uh, this is from their Diamond Edge World Tour. Is this, um, I can't remember if this is a DVD or a Blu-ray card, but it is from a Japanese concert. So I'm just slowly trying to chip away at some of their um, concert DVD and Blu-ray photo cards. Here's the next one with a sweet little note that I unfortunately cannot read, but I always love it when they include these notes and I actually have a little notebook where I keep extra notes and everything. All right, guys, the one non-17 card, although there might, be, there might be another one. I don't know, I can't remember if I ended up purchasing the other 
the boys card <laughs> that I was missing. But either way, uh, we have this Eric card from Maverick. And I've just been really slow at completing Maverick this time around, um, which is fine. I mean, I'm really only missing like, I don't know, like two more cards, I think. Wow, why can I not get this out? Oh, here we go. So yeah, and I just want to say I hope Eric is doing okay. He is on a hiatus right now as of the time that I'm filming this, and I just hope that he is getting all the rest that he needs. Moving on, and <laughs> this was one of the Carrot Land photos or uh, photo cards that I was missing. So this is from the 2021 Carrot Land. This is, I think this is a hollow card as well. It's kind of like a broken glass hollow effect. Really, really pretty. And I love that he's with a moped. And now this is a DK one. Yes. <laughs> so I'm trying to finish up some of his um, older cards. This is from his AL1 card or alone. Um, yeah, slowly working on this. Okay, now we have, oh, this is from Teenage. Looks like it's gonna be DK. And here it is, so cute. It's the green one. Focus, there we go. It is unfortunate that they are horizontal, but they had a lot of horizontal cards for this album, so it is what it is. Okay, so this one, I'm actually going to leave him just like this. So this is Wanu. I do not collect Wanu. However, I got it from Melanie because this is from the Ideal Cut DVD and uh, she pulled DK. I actually ordered the DVD as well, but I pulled June and I haven't been able to find a trade for him. So I was like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and buy Wanu's that way. I can trade with her for DK. And yeah, I don't know. I'm really, really happy that this arrived and it actually looks really really good so I'm super happy but yeah I am gonna leave them in the packaging because I am gonna be packing this up for her really soon so let's move on to this one this is a mystery I have no idea what is gonna be in here but it feels really thick um, <laughs> oh my gosh this is really nice they individually sleeved each of the cards so I really do appreciate that little extra step that they took so these are Joshua's Carrot Land cards. It is his full set. I think these are from 2020, I wanna say. But look at how cute, and it has the unit cards too. <laughs> oh, and it came with the group card as well. I actually forgot it was gonna come with this one too. But yeah, it says here on the back, it is the 2024th fan meeting Carrot Land. So yeah, and here are the backs. These are probably my favorite backs. They are so adorable. Wow, I really love these. All right, well, speaking of Carrot Land, I think this might be 2019 though, I wanna say. Is that right? <laughs> um, let's see here. These, oh my God. <laughs> oh my gosh, hold on. <laughs> these drawings I've never seen that before oh my god <laughs> look at these one. this one DK and Wanu please like <laughs> this is so funny to me oh my gosh this is so cute I am screaming like this is so adorable and then <laughs> this is with Ming Hao <laughs> So Ming Hao drew this of DK, and then DK drew this. Um, so yeah, <laughs> please, he's grabbing his cheeks. That is so cute. Okay, so this says, yes, this is the 2019 Carrot Land. There's his individual photo, and then the rest. I love this color scheme too. I always love the pink, the, any pinky tone, purples and blues. I am such a sucker for. Oh my God, the way my cat's looking at me right now from the box that all the stuff came in. I'm gonna insert a photo right here. Okay, let's keep going. Oh my gosh, I know I keep saying that, but there's so many cards left, like so many. This is gonna take me forever to edit. 
<laughs> so we've got a Joshua set here. We got his pair of cards and these are from Love and Letter. And I was really lucky. Actually, the same seller was selling both sets of his cards. So these are Love and Letter. I feel so fortunate to have these. These were a little bit harder to find. Um, but yeah, the same seller was sort of just getting rid of a lot of his cards. And I'm like, okay, this must be a sign for me to swoop in and grab them. Um, oh, God. oh my gosh. This is really really in there. I'm gonna unfortunately have to cut that. I like to reuse some of these bags, but yeah. Alright, so these are his Boys B cards, and oh, they're a little longer than I expected. That's okay though. And they're a little thinner than I expected as well. Although, yeah, they are a little bit taller than Love and Letter. So anyways, here they are. And here's the back. So yeah, oh my gosh, I'm so happy to have these sets. Okay, next up, actually, I might be able just to slide this right out. Yes, oh, it's another Joshua card. <laughs> Let's see, this is another Going 17 card. I love this one of him with the scarf, it's so cute. Oh my goodness, I started drinking something cold and now I'm like losing my voice. <laughs> it's like made my voice raspier. So I apologize for that. We have DK's other AL1 card. Let me just slide it out. Okay, so here's the back. <laughs> and then here's the front. Looks like a little mini Polaroid. Ooh, this is interesting. So I know I got a DVD card. <gasps> Oh, how precious is this? And it's in English too, so I actually know it says bonus present. Wow, how sweet of this seller. Oh my gosh, I wish I like I knew who this actual seller is. Well, I guess I could probably go on my um, Mercari or my Baiyi profile and check who this came from, but that is so sweet that they gave me. This is like um, a winter O2U type thing. Um, let me see. Okay, so it says it's from the World Tour Japan, the O2U. I don't know, I'm not quite as familiar with the set that this is from, but I'm pretty sure it comes as part of a set. And that is really sweet of this person. Let me try to open this though. But this is one of my favorite DK cards. And it's just so pretty. Oh, I just love the coloring and everything. It's really, really beautiful. But um, this is for Haru. Yeah, so I really want to get the Joshua equivalent as well. Okay, let's see what this is. Oh, hello. Oh, we have a Your Choice. Can't remember what fan sign this is, if it's Yijiu or I think it might be. But yeah, Joshua and DK, they both have some of my favorite photo cards from Your Choice. So... Yay! Alrighty. Let's see what's in here. Aw, it's a little note. Ooh, I like the feel of that paper. Let's see. <laughs> okay, so this is one of DK's um, Japanese Power of Love um, album cards. Well, I don't know if this is maybe. I want to say this might be his Weaver's pre-order benefit, but I can't quite remember. They have a couple of different versions, so let's see here. I think it is. I don't know. I can't remember, but I want to say it's his Weaver's pre-order benefit, but the back is really pretty. How sweet is this note, by the way? It says, I hope that something wonderful will come to you. Okay, let's see what's in this big envelope. Oh. <laughs> It's just another one of these things. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, we have a Haru set. I think this is Joshua's. Yes, it is. I have most of DK's Haru cards from this set, but I'm still missing a few. But I was able to find a seller that had the whole Joshua set, which is really, really exciting. So, 
Yeah, um, because Haru is Japanese, um, these cards are a little bit bigger than um, like standard photo cards, but um, they still fit though in those Amifa pockets. Um, so yeah, they still fit, so no problems there. In fact, they do still fit, this is so cute, they fit in standard Dragon Shield sleeves as well. So that's always nice. Okay, let's see what's in here. I feel like each and every one is a surprise, you know? <laughs> okay, and it is, oh! <laughs> this is my absolute favorite, favorite. Oh my gosh, I wanted this so badly. It was definitely a splurge, um, <laughs> but I really wanted this OTU card. Please, it is so cute. 10 out of 10, my absolute favorite card of his. All right, so I can actually see through this, and I can definitely tell that it's from Power of Love, the Aino Chara. Am I saying that correctly? Or I'll just say the Japanese Power of Love so that I don't completely ruin the pronunciation in Japanese. <laughs> but um, these, I actually cannot remember um, if this is like a universal music or... No, because I think I already got the Universal Music one. I don't know. I cannot remember, but I really love these. this one in particular, DK, with like the yarn concept. And then we have the wintry concept photo. So yeah, I just, I don't know. I just really wanted these and I was trying to finish up um, collecting stuff from this album for both Joshua and DK, but I'm still missing quite a bit. So this one has a really cute little note on it and they drew a bunny, which I always appreciate. And the bunny is my favorite animal, so. <laughs> um, yeah, here's the note, always appreciate that. What do we have here? Oh, yay! <laughs> <laughs> so now we have Joshua's 2019 Carrot Land set. Always appreciate the individual sleeving. Love that. <laughs> like seriously, Mercari Japan just is the best place if you want to get full sets of, of anything, truly. Oh my god, I adore this one. Look at this. <laughs> this Vernon and Joshua card. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, so cute. This is gonna be DK. Yeah, I think it's just one. Yes, it is. It's his teenage card. It's the orange one. Look at him with his cup of coffee. <laughs> well, we're getting into more modern times here. <laughs> more modern era. So we have this Hangare card of Joshua. I think I am only now missing one of his cards, I want to say. But yeah, we are almost completing that. This one was a little questionable the way it came. <laughs> like it was just sandwiched between this notebook paper. So, oh gosh, I hope it was okay. Um, this is Joshua's, I think, Weaver's pre-order card or the Weaver's album card. I have no idea, but yeah, so very cute and um, I don't see any damage or anything or creases so I got really lucky. All right, all right. I might need to cut through this though. Um, this is Joshua. Yes, it is an incomplete card and I think this actually completes my incomplete collection for him. So we love that. Ah, gorgeous, gorgeous photo too. It's probably my favorite one from the set. Okay. See who this is gonna be. Oh, okay. This is a lucky draw because it's hard, so it feels like plastic. So this is definitely a lucky draw. I don't know if it's sound wave or or whatever, but um, oh my gosh, I love these colors so much. This is so pretty. I think we are finally getting towards the end. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, we have another O2U DVD card. And it is a Joshua one. Very beautiful. Let's see who is in here. Another note. I wish I could read this, but it says boo down here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Please, that is so cute. Let's see. Oh, right. Okay, so I did not need this card. 
I think it was these, yes, I think it was these ones that I needed. This is kind of a weird mix. So, okay, let's, let's kind of go through this. <laughs> um, we have a Hengere card, right? And then I think there's two in here. Uh, yes, there's two here. So I still needed this card from Carrot Land. Hopefully it'll focus. There we go. I needed this Carrot Land card still, and it came in a set with these two cards from Hengere that I needed. So I was like, okay, it was a better deal just to get this set together. And it also so happened to come with this extra card from Semicolon. So I was like, all right, that's fine. I can always hold on to him in case I want to trade for something else later. All right. Oh my goodness. <laughs> all right, we see some HMV cards, but I think this might be his teen age, I want to say. So again, another situation where they gave me sets of stuff. Got a pair of these HMV cards. Okay, and then we have these teenage cards. So we have the white one here. So this one is just a little bit harder to find. So I was just really happy to see it offered in a set like this. Then we have this horizontal one, the green one. And then it also came with another HMV card. So yeah, I'm pretty sure that now my set is completed for Teenage. So I think this is going to be my last DK card for this haul. <laughs> um, but I feel like I made pretty good progress though with him. And this is from Going17. So yes, there he is. He's so precious. Alright, so here it is. This is the big one. And I... I kind of just really wasn't sure what to do. So this is Joshua's full unowed set. So there should be 20 photo cards in this pack. So I actually have like maybe half, no, maybe not half, but I already have started collecting an ode for him. Like Melanie pulled him so many times and we did some trades. And I think I may have already bought like two from another seller. But I was just getting kind of like discouraged that I wasn't having very good luck finding all of his other ones and if I were to buy them all individually the total was going to kind of just end up being a lot and very similar to if I were to just buy this whole set from Mercari Japan. So I'm like okay I might as well just buy the whole set if it's going to end up costing the same right? So yeah, um, looks like they put them all in pairs together, which is really nice. So yes, these are all of his Anod cards. <laughs> so let me get all of them out. We have these two. Like I know I'm missing this one for sure. I'm missing both of those. Um, I think I already have this one, but I'm missing this one. Like, it's just the stuff that I'm missing was just kind of like all over the place. So that is fine. I am totally okay just like having these spares and I can always uh, keep or trade or, you know, sell the ones I don't need. Um, I haven't quite decided, you know, how I want to do that yet. But yeah... I don't know. I just, an ode is probably, um, you know, the one album that I think probably takes the longest to try to complete for some people. I mean, I guess it just really depends on the demand at the time, but um, I just really wanted to just get that kind of out of the way and then I could focus more, you know, on other eras. And yeah, so here's Hope. So cute. I know that I was missing this one. I already had this one. But yes, that is actually everything. Let me try to do an overview really quickly. We'll see how well I can get it all in frame. All right, so I tried to get everything in frame, but it really just wasn't going to happen. There's just way too many photo cards. But here are all the other things that I could not fit into frame. We've got a lot of Carrot Land sets and um, this one Eric card <laughs> and all the rest were just Joshua and DK. Um, but yeah, I'm so, so happy. I'm looking forward so much to organizing my binders. So yeah, please come back if you were interested in seeing me organize all these into my binders. Once again, I wanna say a huge thank you to Baiyi for sponsoring today's video. I definitely could not have done this without them. So um, yeah, if you are interested in checking out a proxy 
service or trying out something like that, um, I do have a link for Buy Ye down below where you can get a discount on your first order. But this is where I will leave you today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!